Hey, what up, good people? It's me, Miss Ebony V. Welcome back or to my channel. If you are new to my channel, thank you for stopping through. Hopefully you'll enjoy something you see on this channel and will consider subscribing and joining the family. If you are returning, hey, Shug Muffin. All right, y'all, so we have made it to the end of the year, the end of 2022, and I just wanted to come and tell you all my favorite wigs of 2022. Now, this does include a combination of both synthetic wigs and human hair wigs, where I'm going to be telling you six synthetic wigs and six human hair wigs. I couldn't come up with a full list of 10 for each, so I was just like, let me just merge this together and do six of each, and then, you know, you know, typically people do five and five, but I had to one up and do one more, you know. I had to leave it at six and six, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and start with the synthetic wigs. You'll notice a lot of similarities. Like, when you know what you like in a wig, you tend to gravitate towards that wig. So that's kind of what made it to my top, or my top six for synthetic wigs, to be more specific. So most of these wigs, I consider to have very good quality, and the texture was important to me. Now, there are a few of these that did not come out in 2022. I just happened to have reviewed them in 2022, and they're included on the list. So let's go ahead and dive into my favorite synthetic wigs. I'm going to start with a unit from Studio Cut. It is in the style DPL-002. Now let me tell you, y'all, this unit right here, I mean, it was super long. It had my nice yakky texture. It was absolutely beautiful. Um, even though it was 36 inches, like, I still absolutely loved it. The quality was out of this world. I told you, that quality and texture are very important to me when, it's, when it comes to a synthetic wig. So that's definitely what I got with this one. It felt like human hair, for real. Now let me point out that these wigs are in no particular order. Um, I did not bother trying to rank them, so I am just... Um, just going down the list as they are. So the next wig I'm going to mention is a unit from Outre in the style Marissa. Mm, mm, mm. Another beautiful wig with great quality. She's also another human hair dupe and she has that beautiful yakky texture that I absolutely love. I'm telling you, I gravitate towards these kind of wigs because they just do it for me. <laughs> it was minimal work involved with this unit. I mean, this unit was ready. I'm absolutely gorgeous. All right, so the next wig I want to mention is a braided unit. And it was a knotless braided wig that I got from Amazon. I mean, honey, like I've had several braided wigs. And this one was probably one of my favorites. So, yeah, I still have her on hand. Like, she was, she just looked super natural. All of that gave me vibes. It was just one of the best braided wigs I've tried. And so, again, highly recommend this one. Now, the next three wigs, they did not come out in 2022, as I mentioned earlier. They did come out in a different year, but this is the year that I actually reviewed them. So, I'm going to continue with another Outre unit and the style Brazella. Now, she came out at the end of 2021. I already had her on hand. I just never got around to reviewing her until 2022. But honey, she was so beautiful. Those barrel curls flowing away from the face. The color gave me life, y'all. I mean, this was a gorgeous unit. Now, she did come with a middle part. She had this very beautiful, light, yakky texture. Amazing quality and texture. So again, highly recommend this one absolutely gorgeous. The next wig I'm going to mention is another Outre unit and it is in the style Toriana. Toriana also came out at the end of 2021 and I think I had her then but I didn't review her until 2022 this year. But again, absolutely beautiful. I think with this one, the most important thing was the hairline. The hairline was immaculate on this unit. It looks so natural, y'all. Toriana could also be worn glueless, which was another thing I loved about her. I didn't glue her down, and she looks super natural. It was a beautiful, everyday kind of wig. I mean, you know, it had perfect length. The quality of the hair, I mean, it was just beautiful. No tangling, no shedding. Absolutely gorgeous unit, Toriana. All right, so the last wig that I'm going to mention in my favorite wigs of 2022 
It's a unit from Sensational in the style Janelle, honey. Whew. Janelle was so long and sleek and beautiful, again, with great quality and texture. Definitely got that nice yakky texture with this one, again. Beautiful unit. She had an awesome, a magnificent hairline as well. I mean, I honestly felt like this one looked like my hair. Like, it was so blended. Like, it looks so good, y'all. Like, beautiful. All right, so those were my top six synthetic wigs of 2022. Now we're going to switch over to my top six human hair wigs of 2022. Again, these are in no particular order. I'm just going down my list. All right, so the first wig I'm going to mention in my top six human hair wigs is from Love Me Hair. It is the most perfect glueless bob I've ever had. <laughs> I mean, this wig was so perfect. Super natural looking. It had excellent quality, nice density. It looks super natural, y'all. Most people thought it was my hair when I was wearing it. It's probably one of the best human hair throw on and goes you can come across. It was so perfect. And it was a 4x4 lace closure bob. Perfection. All right, so the next human hair wig is from Nadula, and it is a highlighted honey blonde 4x4 lace closure wig. Absolutely beautiful. Like the color job they did on this was amazing. Very well highlighted, and it blended to perfection. I got so many compliments on this unit as well. It looks super natural when I was wearing it. All right, so the next human hair unit I'm going to mention is from Shein. And yes, it's another beautifully highlighted 4x4 lace closure curly unit. And it was like a curly bob. So cute, y'all. I didn't even know Shein sewed wigs. That's when I learned. That was my very first Shein wigs. And I was like, what? Nobody told me. <laughs> I was so shook it, like, and so happy to have come across it. Very easy wig. It can be worn glueless, although I did glue it down in my video, but you can very well get away with not gluing it down at all. All right, so the last three units are Amazon units. Y'all already know I'm real big on Amazon, right? And especially with my human hair wigs. I get a lot of my human hair wigs from Amazon. So this next wig I'm going to mention is a 13 by 4 lace frontal wig. It actually came in a body wave style, but I decided to straighten it. You know, that's just how I am sometimes. I'm just mood driven. And so I was in a mood for a straight wig that day. Um, and so, yeah, I changed it from body wave to straight, but you can very well leave it in a body wave state. Absolutely beautiful quality hair. I had no issues with this unit. Um, I did pluck it at the hairline as I always do, and it looked very natural. All right, y'all. Somehow, I thought I was recording the last two wigs in the human hair portion of my favorite wigs of 2022, and I was not. So, the remainder of this video will be in a voiceover as I give you my final two wigs. All right, so the next human hair wig I'm going to mention is a 4x4 deep wave lace closure wig from Amazon. This unit had a beautiful curl pattern with very full density. It was very easy because it's a lace closure and it melted nicely. Even though with it being a closure, you can wear it glueless. So I really like the ease of this wig along with the beautiful curls that came along with it. All right, so for the final wig in my human hair section of my favorite wigs of 2022, it is another 4x4 lace closure wig, um, which I added highlights to and it was absolutely beautiful. really did love the quality of this hair and how the hair was nice and soft and sleek. It was a body wave style that I turned into a straight wig as well. So that will pretty much conclude this video of my favorites of 2022. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if any of the wigs that you saw are something you would consider a, a favorite of yours as well. If any of them are new to you and you plan on trying them, let me know down in the comments below. Once again, I apologize for the technical difficulties I've experienced in this video. Um, I do thank you all so, so much for taking the time to watch this video. I truly appreciate it. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you have not. And I will be sure to catch you all in the next video. Bye, y'all.